Congratulations on your purchase of Derex, the world's best-selling industrial drill sharpener. The V390 features a patented design that sharpens drills accurately in less than a minute. The super abrasive sharpening wheel can sharpen up to approximately 2,000 drills. The V390 is designed to sharpen high-speed steel, carbide, cobalt, and parabolic drills, as well as TIN and other coated drills. It sharpens standard twist drills from 1 8 inch to 3 quarters inch and offers quick point angle changes, creating angles from 118 to 140 degrees. Your model V390 is one of the lowest priced industrial grade sharpeners on the market and is capable of turning regular drills into self-centering, fast cutting, high performance drills. Drill Geometry Several key drill terms will be referred to throughout the video. The point angle, the cutting lifts, the web, the chisel edge, the chisel edge angle, and the flutes. The term relief refers to the way the bit falls away behind the cutting lifts to prevent the heel from rubbing. Your Derex has an innovative design that creates the right geometry in all of these areas. It starts with patented dual cams that move the drill in two directions, in and out, up and down, creating exactly the same motion factories use to make new drills. And your Derex uses an industrial strength super abrasive electric plated sharpening wheel so that thousands of drills can be sharpened without the wheel wearing down or changing shape. Split point drills. Your Derex can split the point of any drill. The main advantages to a split point drill are reducing thrust and eliminating walking at the drill point. These are most important when the drill is used in a portable drill or in drilling applications where bushings cannot be used. The split point also has two positive rake cutting edges extending to the center of the drill. This helps produce smaller chips that clear easily out of the hole. The drill digs into material faster and reduces the drill's tendency to walk so you rarely need a pilot hole. To create a split point, a secondary surface is ground from the heel to the tip of the drill. This narrows the web and creates the second set of cutting lifts at the tip of the drill. Split point drills can be particularly useful when drilling in metal. Drills made from specialty materials like cobalt and carbide have thick webs and work best with a split point. Point and lip relief angles. On your Derex, you have the option to adjust the point angle and the lip relief angle on the drill. Many drills have a steeper 118 degree point angle. This angle is good for soft and low strength materials such as some cast irons, aluminum, plastic and wood. Decreasing the point angle increases the length of the lips and decreases the feed pressure. A shallower 135 degree point angle is often preferred for hard and tough materials such as high alloy steels. Increasing the point angle reduces the length of the lips and increases the feed pressure. Depending on the material you are drilling in, you may choose to increase or decrease this angle. You can also adjust the lip relief angle. This is the angle at which the surface of a drill falls away from the cutting edge. To prevent rubbing, the cutting edge must be relieved to permit the chisel edge to penetrate the workpiece. Consult your user guide to learn more about angle adjustments. Stay tuned. The following CD includes a tour of your Derex, a sharpening overview, detailed demonstrations for precision sharpening, and cleaning and maintenance instructions for peak performance. A tour of Derex. The key parts to the Derex are the chuck, the alignment port, the sharpening port, and the splitting port. This is the chuck, the alignment notch that helps position the chuck, the chuck jaws that hold the drill, the chuck knob that tightens the jaws, the split port notch for split alignment, and the chuck cams that generate the drill geometry. Now look at the alignment port. This is the material removal selector knob. This is the relief adjustment settings and alignment paddle. When pushed in, the paddle opens the pawl arms. This is the drill stop. And this is the alignment locating pin. It is used to guide and hold the position of the chuck. This is the sharpening port. These are the cam guides that create the sharpening motion. And this is the point angle selector. This is the splitting port. This tab guides the chuck during the splitting. This is your split angle adjustment indicator. And this is the split depth adjustment knob to control the depth of the split. Here is the cover you remove to replace the sharpening wheel. 
This is the vacuum port. This is the plug. And this is the on-off switch. And this is a set of quick-step setup instructions.